now for the barrel racing. Starting us off is Leslie Schlosser. Well, like all events here at Reno, Jeff, it is tough. Three-tenths of a second separates the entire field of girls that are out this afternoon. Leslie Schlosser from Alberta, the first one we're watching, has a super horse, the best conditions on the ground because she's first. We'll see what she can do. She stops the clock at 17.11. One factor in the barrel racing today, as we watch Vanna Bystander, maybe the heat is almost 90 degrees here in Reno. Another outstanding name in barrel race, Vanna. She's not riding her good horse, which is Lotto Jet. That horse has been out with an injury. This is her backup horse, and a good one, though, at that. Four trips to the national finals. Looking at a 17.11 right now to take the lead away from Leslie. And she does it. Van right now, 18th in the world, needs to make some money as we go to Sue Miller from Watt, Texas. Sue's had great success with this horse. This little horse, Scoot and Flit, is its name. She raised this horse. He's a 10-year-old. She went through the fraternity systems with him, and he is solid. She's going to have to be fast. 17, 14 or faster to take the lead away from Vanna Bysinger. She makes it for the time wow. of 17, 12. And now there's a team that everybody loves to watch. Charmaine Rodman and Scamper. What a team. Ten national championships for this team. But you know, she's letting him off the hook a little bit this year. She's only ridden Scamper three times since the Houston rodeo that was held in March. But she's had great success with her backup horse, Magic. As she and the general head out of the arena. Good run. 1730, not fast enough to move her to the lead, but she does lead the world standings coming into today. Now to Rona Bowler, Grand Junction, Colorado. If she's 1734 or faster, she'll steal the win from Sue Miller. That's a lot of pressure right now. Remember last year, she won second at this rodeo. She's very capable. Rona, a little disadvantage. She's on the bottom of the ground. She's watched some girls make some great runs. Oh. You see your time come up there, 17.49. So Sue Miller gets the win, makes over $7,000. Vanna Bystinger, a good showing there. Finishes in second place with Leslie Schlosser, finishing third.